Hey, welcome back. And um, previously, we started the uh, we started the what do we call that quest deadlock protocol, and uh, we are midway through it. And we need to go to Fortuna so that we can proceed further in the quest. And uh, if anybody's new, yeah, subscribe the channel and uh, leave a like if you wish to support the channel. And uh, yeah, it'll be a great help if you do. But anyways, so Nefani wants to prove that he's the son of that uh, or illegitimate, illegitimate or whatever, son of that uh, power guy and we need to stop him. So stay tuned. How many kids are going to grow up in the feds because of this? How many parents lost because I couldn't do my job? You did. There's a vent kid a very long time ago who would have hero worshipped the woman she became. You're enough. <sighs> if Neff intends to visit that pocket for his proof, he won't risk himself. Not at first. Sparky, you can beat him to it. This has figured out how to activate Neff's Granum tributes. You won't believe this. These tributes are essentially uh, coin operated. You'll need a Granum crown. You'll have to search the ship. Neff as the Corpus figurehead with the United Board behind him, will be held for us and workers everywhere. See if you can get across first. Tax whatever proof he's hoping to collect, muck up his plan, and find our people. To cross over, you'll need to find a Granum Crown first. Search the area. If you make it across, keep an eye out for our people. They may have survived. I've told more than enough kids their parents aren't coming home. Time to tax the tax man. If only Parvos could have lived to see this day. Imagine his face, beaming with pride, as he bestowed upon me his son, that sacred golden hand. My surgeons have assured me the procedure will be quick and painless. A pound of old flesh for a glorious new legacy. I'd pay top credits to crap in Neff's coffin. Double if he was still alive. The <laughs> oh, ah! One scan of Parvo's granum, and my lineage shall be proven. None shall deny me What? Tenno? Again? Not today. As Parvos is heir, it is my offering to make! I am coming, Father! It is I who shall... 
shall pay tribute. Your death is almost home. They must not reach him before we do. Is that understood? Him? As if the body would still be intact. Something's up. Get to the tribute. Expect some friction. We've got a lot on you, Elf Welder. Good luck. It has been so long since these old eyes beheld another living thing here in the sanctuary. I am Parvos Granum. Thank you for finding me. I the Void. You are alive. My faith never wavered. I live. Treachery seethed within the heart of the faith I had built when the Bard's assassins overloaded my transport's void drive. Protea, my beautiful Protea, and her gift for manipulating time preserved me. cost of all that she was. Now, she is nothing more than a specter of her former self. My beautiful Protea. That is why you have been invited here. Father, permit me to show you all I have built in your name. Do Nef on you that honor. My name. Hmm. I have watched you. Monuments to narcissism, demanding others sweat in your stead, gorging upon that which you have not earned, watched as you claimed for yourself my teachings of self-reliance, perverting them into a flaccid philosophy of sloth, of idleness. Is that you, my son? No, that must be a different son. You know nothing. Falling short as you do of every idea that I value. Your words, your efforts, are the model of inadequacy. I called you Nathaniel, but I do not need you. I need... them. Them? Tenno? Father! You're making a mistake. Come now. Protea has scanned her kin, and with that, she is reinvigorated. Now, my lovely, if you wouldn't mind, show our guests the door. <laughs> We've got a lock on you, Outwelder. Good luck. What? What the hell? Outwelder, I'm pulling sensory feeds from a trip you haven't taken yet. And hearing myself say things I've never said in a place I've never seen. Parvos? Yudi, you should see this. What if Nef has similar logs? This has a handle on the time jump, but we've got bigger problems than Nef now. Get out of there! Not good enough, am I? Inadequate, am I? You've been watching me, have you? Well, watch as I show you how we do things these days. Crews, repel those specters! We have bigger fish to fry.
Vox Solaris. Our interests have come to align. Now, this situation is no one's fault, and I'm not one to point fingers, but my fleet and your workers are facing the same danger. Convince your Tenno servant to re-enter Granum's domain and disable that Proteus Spectre. I have just the thing they'll need, but there is some assembly required. You want to rescue those comrades trapped in there, and I want to keep the past where it belongs. Dead and buried. Deal? Neff's a bloviating narcissist with the morals of a haunted chainsaw, but at least that makes him predictable. Parvus. That mucker is something else. I don't trust Neff, but if any of our own are still alive in there, we have to try. Biz will lead the build on this Zorus gizmo. for an old Grenum file. Phantasmic scintilla and motive forces. We'll need more specifics to build whatever this tool is. Cypher works as promised. Some doors ought to remain closed. Now that's not in my worldview. Fire, fusion, void. Progress always comes entangled with risk, with violence. With the precious sample obtained, development is accelerated. The Entrati have kept their secrets long enough.
I am calling it the Spectre Particle. As my Archimedians explain, mimicry is in its nature. An echo exposed to precept circuits, we are able to imprint behaviors like an infant mirroring her surrogate. Only this infant can set the world on fire. Drake controllers. They hit our research site with a Warframe assault team. Of course they did. I baited them to do it. The whole site lit up. 18 megatherm bloom. The whole lab vaporized. Those Warframes with it. Fire. Fusion. Void. Parforce Granum originated Spectre Particle Theory? Guts. This old coot is a whole other order of intelligence, and that's bad for us. Get back to your ship. I need to figure out this Zorus thing. work, Biz. Sparky, listen up. Biz's findings indicate Parvis might be close to translating himself from that reality into our own. We're not exactly sure how, but we're getting some odd readings. You've got to build the Zorus before Parvis gets free.
a weapon. Glaive class, but with an energy trap. Spectre particles, maybe. Has a mid-flight detonation trigger. Tricky, but I'm sure you'll get the hang of it. Gear up and let's go.